Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm back with some more Pokemon Nuzlocke. Uh, let's see, last time we went to go fight Legends by accident, and now we're gonna go back to Mount Moon. Just real quick, because I think there might be trainers beyond them. Uh, we're gonna start heading off to go fight, um, Koga's daughter, who I can't remember the name of right now. Um, but we're gonna go do that, too. There's plenty of training we need to get done. Uh, we need to start training Nightmare, because Nightmare is gonna be the one... I think the one unit that can stand against her psychic types and not die to psychic moves. Uh, we haven't caught anything here either, so if we find a Clefairy, maybe we can catch it. But yeah, that's today's, today's episode, basically. We're gonna be calm about it. Be real cool about it. And, of course, we run into another Pokemon. Ooh, okay. I don't have you. Let's get it. Let's see. Uh, hmm, Ultra Ball. Take this ball. Directly to the face. Damn it. You're annoying. You're annoying me, Clefairy. Annoying Pokemon don't get to live. Hmm, excuse me if I sound a little bit tired. I just got finished streaming, beating all of Rayman 2. It was more tiring than I thought. I'm wondering if I should, um... I'm wondering how... I don't know. It was a lot of fun. Um... Give a nickname. We're gonna call you... We're gonna call you... Move. Welcome to the team, Move. Um... It was fun. Now that I've caught a Pokemon here, I no longer am interested in anything I find here, so it's time to use Repel. Of course Nightmare is asleep, I forgot. I can just use Poke Flu though. <sighs> hmm, Poke here. Is that not gonna wake him up? Hmm. I thought it would. It's weird. Repel real quick. What? Where am I? Oh, that sounds ominous. I can use a little bit more repels. Just a little bit of soda pop. Lem lemonade, I mean. Does the soul good. Just in case I need to just heal 80 and that's it. There's really no point to them now in the late game, but I have them. Good enough for me. Oh shit, I forgot to un to wake up Nightmare. <laughs> we got this. But yeah, Rayman 2. Hell of a game. It hurt. Hurt me. Picnic Hope. Laugh. Alright, it's time to wake up, Nightmare. Wake up and kick ass. In that preferable order. I didn't realize how much overloaded we were. Are you kidding me? Are you having a laugh, as the English would say? Why are you lowering my speed? I'm already paralyzed. Well, you're dead now. Don't make me laughy, Flappy. Oh, what? Die. Die. And what are the chances of actually getting paralysis on the Thundershock? I feel like it's super low compared to anything else. 421! Blaze it. Goodbye, ho. I am very strong, thank you. Another full heal. Yeah, and I'm trying to figure out what the next stream game I should do. I have a feeling by the time you hear this, I will already know what it is. I've had some ideas for it. I basically want to push the stream and see how far 
um, my internet can handle it, basically. So it'll probably be something really fast. But we'll see. We'll see. Word Keeper Hake! <sighs> what? <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> Hank, what are you doing here, my dude? What are you doing here with a level 12 Pidgey? What is wrong with you? 69, nice. 421 and 69. This better be a super strong Pidgey up. Oh god, that was the mom. Or the dad. That's more like it. Give me a challenge. That Pidgeot sprite's pretty nice. I never liked the way Pidgeot's hair looked like. It looks too weird to me. There's always a personal hang-up. Headbutt. Bonk. It's still funny to me how much headbutt is so much better than confusion at this point. Eventually it's not gonna be like that, but for now it's pretty funny that it is like that. Hank. That's news to me. These guys also don't give a lot of money. Why am I so damn sleepy? Maybe I'm not getting enough rest. I don't know. I've been constantly afraid that the current schedule that we're on, and you know, with everything going on, there's a part of me that's really afraid that I might be depressed in some way. Um, just because one of the sy symptoms of depression is that you don't feel like being awake. Like you never want to leave bed, you just want to stay asleep the entire time. That's one of the early signs, um, from what I understand it anyway. Obviously there's a lot more that goes into depression, and you should always be on the lookout if you might get it. But I was always afraid that, like, um, so I've always been very, I guess, cognizant of trying to be, like, of, um, keeping check of my mental well-being. If I'm going to bed, is it because I'm feeling a certain way? Um, am I feeling unfulfilled in some matter of life or something. Um, I don't know, that kind of stuff is very hard to keep track of. Especially when it's like... Um, and I think the reason I know that I'm not is that I know people who are do, do constantly suffer from depression. Um, and it just feels like their life is very different from... From the way they act is very different away from mine. Um, so maybe it's a little bit of me just being a little bit too cautious. Maybe I'm fine, but... You know, you can never be too sure. Because, you know, I am a very happy person, but that doesn't mean that happy people don't also, in some way, um, you know, suffer the same thing as, you know, regular people, I suppose. Um, sometimes the, the people who seem happiest are the ones who are super, like, needing of help of something. Um, and I've always been definitely the kind of person who's, like, um who's needed help in the past, and I've never really asked for it, so I've always been kind of afraid that when I need the ultimate help, I'm not gonna ask for it, and it's gonna be a real issue. Um, hasn't happened. Doesn't mean it won't happen. It could happen. But, you know, you never know. Keep vigilant, is what I'm saying. Huh. Oh, they made that guy's house a freaking de police department. Yeah, I remember this. He was a thief, by the way. Diglett. Did you ever learn Dig, little buddy? And by little buddy, I mean murderer. Horrible, horrible murderer. Mm, bet he didn't. Alright. It's time to start heading on my way. But yeah, put that kind of self-reflection right there. It's me thinking. That's all I got now. Nowadays is my own thoughts. So yeah, this is the one way I always try and feel like, um, uh, the one thing I know that will guarantee me some form of, like, sadness is if I don't try and increase, if I don't try and, like, do something artistic, um, meeting, like, with art and stuff, just in case someone thought I, I said another word, um, because sometimes my words get a little bit mixed up because of my tongue. Um, it's tough. Especially because, like, the creative side of me sometimes just doesn't want to come out. But it also wants to come out, so... It's a never-ending struggle. 
Let's see if we can find a Pokemon here. Nope. Nope. There we go. Let's see. Brand new Pokemon, brand new Pokemon. I already have you, Jiren. Leave my sight. Female Jiren. Oh. Don't like the idea of that. Do you think a female Jiren of Jiren's race from Dragon Ball Super would also be bald? Like, uh, or basically of anyone of any of his gender. Um. Ah. <clears throat> Choked on my spit. Could you imagine him with hair? Hey, grammar. Did I already catch one of you? No, I killed you, I think. Alright, it's time to actually catch you then. Or try. I'm pretty positive that he went away. Space. I know exactly what to call you. You are Grimes. And my statement on the artist Grimes. Alright everyone, that's it for today's episode. I hope you liked it. If you did, remember to hit that like button and I'll see you guys in the next one as we go down downtown. Goodbye.